before we went out of the live, some people were asking Greg how he was doing. So, how are you doing? I'm doing well. I'm doing amazing. Mm -hmm. I'm blessed. Thank you for your prayers. Please keep praying. I'm not out of the woods yet, but you know, God says it's done, so it's done. Mm -hmm. Amen. Well, tell them that it is um, quarantine and you've been going out. Yeah, I've been going out. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> a bag of chips or something, you know. Those yes, are necessary, but we don't have the ones I want when I want them. So. Greg has ran out. <clears throat> and it's okay to run out, I think. But I think you need to wear a mask and I think you need to wear gloves. Seriously, if you have to run somewhere. Like, I literally have to go to the bank tomorrow. If I don't, I need to go there by Friday. I need to go look for Lysol. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Uh -uh. We do need more. We might need more, but you don't need to go out, like, looking, like, searching. Well, I'm going to find it. I mean, if you call them, they're going to tell you no. No, they not. Okay. You think so? Yeah. Are you going to drive all over town looking for stuff? I'm going to section the county off into four quadrants. Mm -mm. And I'm going to drive each quarter on a different day. Mm -mm -mm. Yes. So, we wanted to come over here first because we're going to actually be going over to YouTube to do um, a live and talk and have um, what we call pillow talk. Couples conversation. Grown folks stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So, we're going to do it over on YouTube. Sorry, I'm just eating halls. Just get your grown on. I've heard, we've heard so much. We've heard that you should keep your throat warm, drink tea, hot, hot liquids, goggle with warm salt water. So I have a bag of halls. I like halls anyway. I'm raspy anyway. So. Lady told me you pee on a hot rock. And do what? And that should get rid of the virus. Craig is strict. No, I'm not. I don't know I told you that. Well, then how many people would have peed on the rock by now? I don't follow this lady around and see how many number I don't people know, but I mean, so you, 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 you was actually talking to somebody when you were supposed to be six feet away? Oh, so she yelled from over there, pee on the rock! I don't think no, so. No, she was in a place where I went. She was at the counter. Oh, you, oh okay. I was behind, okay. way behind. And oh, she no, was telling this guy, native, native secrets, you can... Pee on a hot rock if you, if you can find a hot rock. I don't think so. You was talking to somebody, and I told you you're not supposed to talk to people. I had my distance. Okay, now you you may have something. You gonna have to go back down there. Okay. Are you serious? You may have something, and then I'm gonna be sick, and I'm afraid. You see what I'm saying? Greg is up there talking to people at the grocery store. Oh my at God! The post office. That's even worse. Why? Because look how many people be in the post there office. There wasn't many, but four people in there. That's a shame. See what I'm saying? See how these people be doing? They be out talking like Greg every day. He's got to go run somewhere. He pretend he got to go run somewhere. You sent me. What did I see you to? The post office. You didn't go to the post office? Yes, I did. Where else did I go? How do you mail stuff? Oh, I didn't know you went to the post office. I thought you said you were going to go to the mailbox store. No, I went to the post office. Well, you should try going to the mailbox store because the post office is going to be a little too much. There's so many pillows up here. I got to move something out of my way. So, um. I'm taking away my backdrop. Oh, you need this one? I need something back there. You know, I'm going to slide between these pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. I ain't quite the man I used to be. Uh-uh. Not -uh. ain't quite the man you used to be, honey. Mm -hmm. That's a whole problem, child. No, it ain't no problem. You ain't quite the man you used to be. So, anyway. Come on, this way. That way. This way. Like a show up up here. Show up. Really show up. I don't know about that. Greg is a trip. 
I'm, I'm so smart, I know what's in every book and every library all over the world. I know what's in them too. What? Writing. No, words. <laughs> Same thing, Same thing. Pictures and some of them. Right, but it's some of them. You said in all of them. And I said writing. Same thing as words. I do too. So, anyway, um, Go over to YouTube. Everybody's over there. Wendy Williams, who's a friend of mine, she's over there. She does her thing at 6 p.m. every day over on YouTube. Uh, a lot of people are on YouTube. On Friday, I'll be on Entertainment Tonight. Um, just talking and giving everybody an update on what we're doing while all of this is happening. Um, every day, somebody else asks me, what, what, what have I been doing? Um, I've been really strict about staying in, so and and quarantine and chill. The Greg has been. You ain't been too strict about sending out. Well, you ain't got no problem going out because if you said no, you didn't want to. I already had somebody that was gonna come and do the groceries, and I said we could do Instacart or we had a friend that could go grocery shopping. You did not want them to go grocery shopping. No, because I've got to look for the new stuff. What new stuff? Come, they come out with new products and new packaging. It's important. Okay. See if it grabs me when I walk down the aisle. I'm a country inch of shopper. That wasn't, well, this is not the time to be that kind of shopper. So you, you need to go in the store and get what you're going to get and come back out. Well, we could have used Instacart and then we had somebody that could go to the grocery store for us. So he really didn't have to go out. Like he just went out because he wanted to go out. So we had somebody that could do all this stuff for us. He basically want to go out every day. <clears throat> you see what the people are saying. You're supposed to stay in to help other folks. Did I go out today? You tried to go out today. Did I go out today? You, but going every other day is. But did I go out today? You didn't, but you it wanted to. It has to, to go start out. from somewhere. Okay, so you're gonna be in from now. I, did I go out today? But no. are you gonna be in from now? But did I go out today? You didn't go out today. Okay, now let's see what happens tomorrow. Oh, I can tell you what's gonna happen tomorrow. You already prepared. You got all your stuff lined up to go tomorrow. You ready to go out tomorrow? Well, you know I have to go out tomorrow. Why? I have to go to the post office. You do not have to go to the post office. You can stop saying that. You do not have to go to the post office. First of all, you said if you were going to go out, you can go to the mailbox store. And if you don't go to the mailbox store, then we have somebody that can come out and pick this stuff up and, and mail it because they're already out anyway. So they didn't mind coming back picking this stuff up. You didn't want them to. That dude knows me running. I go to the post office. What no, guy knows me running, Greg? In, in the mailbox store. Oh, God. So, no, I can't deal with that one. I go to the post office. See, they know me. They put me to the front of the line and everything. How you know the man knows me run? I've never seen his nose run. Well, you must not have looked at his nose. Okay, maybe I didn't. I don't have as much. But child, I got to go. See y'all. I'll be back. <laughs>